Hey guys. Hey, and that's who you got. My name is Money. My name is Abby. And together we are The Modern, Modern Things. Things. You guys might have noticed that I've not done my makeup today. So both of us, we're unshowered, unready, and we figured while we're in self-isolation, yes. why not show you guys how we get ready for events? You guys are always asking me to show you how I do my makeup. Yep. So we figured today was like the perfect day since we got nothing to do. <laughs> so as Abby's mentioned, we're just going to show you guys what it takes whenever we get ready for Indian events. Um, we basically just go down to our garage. We've got a huge closet full of Indian outfits. We just decide what color we're going to wear and then we start from there. Yep. So we got shoes? we'll show you guys the process. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. Cholo Modern Things okay. Garage. Wow, baby, you look so beautiful. Shut up. Your outfit. Shut your socks. I'm not going anywhere. What's the point? Okay, cello. Cello. Cello, cello. This is my fancy side of my wardrobe. And I have all these beautiful outfits, none of which fit me anymore. Like, okay, so this is a, a brand new one that Money's mom brought me back from India and oh, it's so gorgeous and it doesn't fit me. I have like... <laughs> Anything will fit me in here, it's maybe this one because it was like a little bit baggy. Okay. We'll try it. We'll try it. So unfortunately guys, that did not fit Abby, so we've gone with the white and orange suit. Red, babe. And, um, <laughs> You guys haven't seen this one actually, because my brother gave it to me the other day. He said it was mine. I don't think it's mine, but I take it. And I'm gonna wear my orange corta piyama, and I was gonna wear her white and orange suit. I'm and, gonna kill you. And one other thing, guys, I always iron all of my suits and Abby suits before we go out. Like I'm OCD like that. I will always iron every single item. Let's go. <laughs> Wait, I'll shower you iron. I'll shower you iron. You shower me iron. I'll shower and you can iron. Oh, okay, yeah. I think I'll shower you iron. <laughs> what? Like, no. Is this like a Scottish slang? Like, no. To Okay, so before you start your makeup guys, always remember to get your hair out of your face. Instead of using like a normal primer or whatever, I usually just use a moisturizer. Um, just, I don't know, I feel like it works better for my skin and it leaves it actually like hydrated afterwards. So I know a lot of like makeup artists and beauty people do it the other way around, but I really like to do my foundation first. So I'm just gonna go straight in with that. I like to use a beauty blender with it as well. I have one of like the microfiber ones. So I've just sprayed a little bit of setting spray onto it to make it a little bit damp as well. And then it should help it stay on your face too, which is perfect. Always blend into your neck. <laughs> No one likes that bad, like harsh line, like right here. The next part is for concealer. So I will just put some under my eyes to get rid of the bags, down the middle of my nose and up here just to kind of highlight that area. And at the very bottom of my chin here. Again, take your beauty blender or whatever you like to do to like blend your makeup and just kind of dab it right in there. So now that my concealer is blended, the next part I just like to put a little bit of um, powder foundation on. So as you can see, oh my gosh, I use these shades all the time. So <laughs> I kind of mix the two. One's a really cool tone and one's quite a warm tone. So I kind of like mixing them. And then you just kind of want to put it on your cheekbone, like right here. I don't really have much of a cheekbone. I've got really chubby cheeks. So for me, when I put on contour, it really helps because I have absolutely no definition <laughs> in that area at all. So this kind of helps it look like on camera that I do. And as well as on the cheeks, I like to put just a little bit up on the forehead here. And I put a little bit under my chin as well <laughs> because as you guys may have noticed, 
since I got pregnant, I'm getting a little bit of a double chin. So by putting it up the top and down the bottom of your face, it just kind of helps to try and make your face look smaller and more defined, you can say. Life hacks. So next, I'm just going to put a little bit of blush just on the apple of my cheeks here and just on the end of my nose. I love my highlighter and honestly I swear this palette is like the best palette I've ever used um, as you can tell so it's like a shimmer palette so there's like a white and gold highlighter both of which oh my god are just the best things ever I've got one of the massive highlighting brushes it just saves me some work so I just go in very lightly on the top and just do that and bam we have highlight So if you put the highlighter on the end of your nose and the top of your lip as well, it can just kind of define those areas as well, just make them stand out a little bit more and you look kind of more glowy. So that is everything done for my face. So I'm just going to move on to my eyebrows now. So I just use a little gel and then afterwards I kind of go in with this pen and just kind of try fill them out a little bit more. So first thing you want to do for the eyes, I usually just mix so these two really light shades here with like a big brush and I just kind of go all over my lid with those two colors. For the next part I usually just use this shade right here, um, just take a little bit and I just kind of put that on um, the outside and just kind of put it in the crease here. Baby you're talking so loud and I can hear you. So if I was going out to an event, I usually would want a little bit of shimmer on my face. So I'm just going to go in with this gold shimmer here. It usually just makes the eyes pop. And I'm going to put it on the outer corners and just kind of in the middle. Um, and then we'll blend some darker shades around it on the outside. So I'm just going to go back in with um, these two brown shades here. And just kind of again to find that. Um, in a pot. So for the last one, I'm just going to go in with this dark shade here with a little brush and I'm just going to put it on the very outer corner here and just blend in a little bit to those more neutral shades just so it kind of creates the effect of like gold shimmer, then a little bit of bronze and then a dark shade. So it's like a little fade out. So the next part is the eyeliner. So you guys know me, I love a nice big cat eye <laughs> with a nice wing. All we're gonna do is curl the lashes, not because you are wanting them to be curly and long, honestly it's just so that they can go with that natural curve of fake lashes, because um, fake lashes are usually, yeah, like nice and accentuated upwards so we don't want our natural lashes going straight and then them going up and you can obviously see that you're wearing fake eyelashes the main thing you want is it to look seamless so that you're not even wearing any and people will be like are those your real eyelashes while we're just waiting on all of our eyeliner and mascara drying because we want that to all be fully dry before we put on the glue for the eyelashes i'm just gonna pick up a lip color so i'm gonna go with a red lip classic red Wow, my lips look so bright in this camera angle. Wow, okay. <sighs> now it's time for the hardest part, the fake eyelashes. So you just need to put a little bit of glue on the strip and then just wait about 30 seconds for it to dry a little bit. Um, just so when you put on your eye, you don't want it to be like runny. You want it to be like kind of sticky and tacky just so it has like something to stick to. If it's runny, it's just gonna fall straight off your eye or like <laughs> move around and we want it to like stay in the one place, you know? And that's it guys. That's simple. Now I just need to add jewelry and a bindi and I'm good to go. This is me. And now you can see how easy money's routine is because literally all he has to do is go for a shower, brush his hair and he's ready. How unfair is that guys? How unfair? But I hope you enjoyed getting ready with me and doing my makeup. 
So guys, I've now finally had a shower and it's now my turn to show you guys how I get ready and what kind of makeup I use on a day-to-day -day basis. I'm just joking, I don't use any makeup guys. But yeah, basically, I've got a very simple life. You know, I just blow dry my hair, I put lotion on my face, um, I put gel, you know, on my beard and my face and just comb it out and I'm good to go. Hands down, baby, you look so nice. Thank you. Your makeup is on point. You did such a good shukriya, job. Shukriya, shukriya ji. Tamba. Your bindi looks nice. You're only missing Thank a tikka. I am missing a tikka. I love wearing titty guys, but there's just no point for staying home. <laughs> Next time we go to an event, I'll wear one. And you guys have already seen the suit. Man, this so, beautiful orange suit, man. I'm walking out of We are finishing this it's topic red. once and for all. Baby, it's not red. It's red. It's orange. It's red. It's orange. It's red. It's orange. We can just keep going back and forth. It's red. It's orange. It's red. It's orange. And this is my outfit, guys. Going out outfit. If I'm ever coming to one of you guys' events, I actually really like this color. It's the, nice. The thing is, my brother gave me this and I didn't even know I had it. It's very nice. And it just it fits really I like nice. the buttons on the side as it's, well. It's really cool, isn't it? Yeah. My makeup's on point, isn't it? Perfect. <laughs> okay, bye guys. Bang! We're ready. Wow, what a change. What a changeover. Definitely for me. Not so much you. <laughs> no, but You baby. kind of look the same. You always look beautiful as well. Aww. But yeah, guys, we really hope you guys really enjoyed this vlog because you guys have been asking for it for a while. I'm seeing Abby's makeup and we just... We thought, why don't I do something as well, innit? <laughs> so, if I was going to a real event, I would have on some like big earrings, a necklace, and a tikka as yeah. well. Um, life hack, guys, if you don't already know this, Money's little cousin told me this and it saved yes, my life. Yes, it did. Put some eyelash glue on the back of your tikka and mm. like hold it and glue it onto your head. It never moves all night, no matter how much you sweat, it stays in place. Since we're not going out anywhere, I'm not gonna do all that. <laughs> this is enough. <laughs> this is it, guys. I cannot believe we did this entire video getting ready and we ain't even going out anywhere. Invite We're us. We're gonna sit home and watch. Guys, this please movie. invite us to your wedding. <laughs> invite us to your Jago event, your Vatna. We won't even be allowed in them at the moment. That's true. Yeah. Invite us next year. We're just gonna just watch a movie and chill now. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, baby. Always remember, guys. We like are not that couple, yes, we are not that couple.